Has life gained a foothold on a planet that orbits our nearest star? This question, which is a variation of one of the greatest mysteries humans have pondered, is now front and center in astronomers' minds. The short answer, of course, is nobody knows. But over the coming months, years, and decades, scientists will throw every instrument and clever technique they have at Proxima b, an Earth-sized planet warmed by a small, cool star in Centaurus, to find out whether there is an existence of alien life there or not. One such weapon used by scientists will be the newly launched James Webb Telescope. So, let's talk about it. Welcome to Cosmos Lab, your one station for all the news from space. Join us in today's video to find out what has the James Webb Telescope found out about alien life on Proxima b. The James Webb Space Telescope has successfully unfolded its gold mirrors and calibrated its instruments to start working and start taking beautiful and detailed images of the universe around it. But the mission has only just begun. According to its creators, Webb, the world's most powerful telescope, will peer into the depths of our universe and is expected to make once-in-a-lifetime discoveries. Since the 1990s, scientists from around the world have studied planets that exist outside of our solar system. The Hubble Space Telescope played a huge role in locating and identifying different planets much like our own. Now, with the power of Webb's infrared instruments, we will be able to see many more exoplanets in even greater detail. From smaller terrestrial planets to Jupiter-sized ocean worlds and beyond, Webb will measure the presence of specific elements in their atmospheres to piece together what kinds of worlds have been littered among the stars. Talking about exoplanets, one of the closest exoplanets to Earth has been discovered by scientists recently, and it is called Proxima b. Proxima b was discovered in 2016 and is thought to be a rocky terrestrial planet slightly larger than Earth that some scientists predict could contain liquid water. It orbits very close to its small red dwarf star, so it's likely to be tidally locked with a permanent night side. According to scientists, if there are aliens living on the planet, then the civilization may deploy powerful mirrors or require very bright LED-style lights to illuminate their cities. They suggest that using near-infrared instruments on the James Webb Telescope and looking for telltale signs of LED light waves and the light from the planet and its host star, they will be able to detect this artificial light if it exists. There are several ways you could tell alien technology exists on other planets. For example, we might be able to see the light of a distant world waver with the transist of a massive constellation of satellites. Atmospheric pollution may be detectable from nuclear conflict, but while these indications of technology could also be caused by natural phenomena, like orbiting debris or comet impact, artificial illumination is distinct from natural light of stars. In other words, if Proxima b hosts a civilization, JWST would detect it. As Proxima b orbits so closely to its host star that it might be tightly locked, meaning that one side of the planet always faces the star while the other is in perpetual night. Therefore, according to scientists, a civilization on a tidally locked planet may need to focus on illumination infrastructure and could possibly use very bright orbital mirrors to reflect sunlight onto the night side of the planet, which could be seen by our telescopes. In addition, the new found world has the compelling label of lurking in the habitable zone. But planets in this Goldilocks region of space, where the heat from their host star makes them neither too hot nor too cold to sustain liquid water, are not necessarily habitable or inhabited. Proxima b may have no flowing water, a prerequisite for life as we know it. On Earth, life flourished with the help of an atmosphere and magnetic field the latter of which shields us from the worst of the space radiation. No one knows if Proxima b has either of these. And so begins the effort to learn more. 
Ignis Snellen, a professor of astronomy at the Leiden Observatory, calls Proxima b the most important planet found beyond the solar system since the first 51 Pegasi b was spotted by Dieter Colos and Michael Mayer in 1995. This is the discovery of the year, and possibly the decade, Snellen says. Not only does it mean an Earth-sized planet orbits our nearest star, it implies that other such worlds are common. It will be our prime laboratory for the research for extraterrestrial life for the decades ahead. We have no idea whether life could exist on this planet, but the circumstances are likely to be much more favorable than on Mars," he says. In the language of astronomers, Proxima b is nearby, but 4.2 light-years away is 40 trillion kilometers. At the speed of Voyager 1, the only human-made object in space between the stars, a spacecraft would take 80,000 years to reach Proxima Centauri. With new technology like James Webb Telescope, that could potentially be halved. However, as the star is relatively small, this habitable zone is close to the star, meaning the planet is tidally locked, with one side always facing the star. There is also speculation that it is very unlikely life could have developed on the day side due to a constant stream of intense radiation from the host star. Proxima b, orbiting just 4.5 million miles out, or about the tenth of the distance Mercury is from the Sun at its closest point. Radio signals have already been detected from the area around Proxima b. However, radio astronomers believe this was likely just an interference from natural sources. This raises a rather obvious question. Can it support life? The planet Proxima Centauri b orbits within its star's habitable zone, the distance at which water might exist in liquid form. Whether there is any liquid present depends in part on whether the planet supports an atmosphere, and that is a hard question to answer. If Proxima Centauri b had formed near its present orbit, it might have seen its early atmosphere blown away during one of its host star's more active phases. But researchers know frustratingly little about the evolution of red dwarf stars like Proxima Centauri. Furthermore, the planet might have formed farther out and migrated inward later, in which case the star's activity wouldn't matter. Since we can't reason out whether there's an atmosphere, the alternative is to look for one. This isn't as easy as it sounds. Despite being the closest star, it's still about 4.25 light-years away, far enough to be an observable challenge. In the search for alien life, an unrelated study also exploring the potential uses of the James Webb Space Telescope suggested it could spot signs of alien life as soon as 2026. It has the ability to detect signatures made by living creatures, and Ohio State researchers say it could find life on another planet in under 60 hours. And with that we have come to the end of our video. What are your thoughts on today's video? Share with us in the comments section below. If you like the content, do give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Until next time, have a great day and thank you for watching.